Hello, thanks for tuning in. I wanted to do a quick tutorial on a new feature in Filmora 9. Uh, it is a new feature that I believe is way overdue and super helpful in the past. Only Adobe programs were doing this. Um, so what I wanna do here is show you how to adjust the horizon line on some of your videos. So let's drop this in here. And so we have a video clip. You can see I'm banking left and my horizon has gotten all messed up, all messed up, but that's okay. We can fix this. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to double click and it's going to bring me up to this special menu. The first option is going to be transform. Um, I'm going to slide this here on the rotate. You can see I can spin the video all the way around. Uh, very, very helpful. All right. So let's go ahead and just eyeball it real quick and try to get some kind of improvement on this horizon line. The severity of this horizon line does change um, as I continue through the bank. So let's see. can also change it numerically. Um, so we'll leave it here. We'll call that a th even three. And one thing you'll notice is these triangles at the top, bottom, left and right. Um, we want to zoom in on that and get rid of those. Um, it offers us a, a solution here with this scale option. And so what we'll do is we can zoom in and out on this. So what we'll do is zoom in just enough so that those little black triangles are no longer there. All right, click OK. It will show the ghosted, clipped out sections of the video here, but this, the, these hard lines um, are what you'll see on the final product. As you can see, horizon lines much cleaner, a lot better. Um, let's do this again for a different example. Um, I'm going to bring in this watermill clip. All right, and. Um, it's not really a horizon issue here, um, but you will notice that this edge of the watermill is at a slight angle. Maybe, maybe it would look better straight up and down. Um, you know, beauty's in the eye of the beholder, but um, this is just a good example I can use. So let's go ahead and rotate this, get that straight up and down. Um, again, you'll see even larger black triangles in this example. So let's go ahead and uh, zoom that in, get rid of those. You are losing some of your video and some of your resolution, uh, which is why it's always good to shoot in 4K. Um, so you have a little wiggle room to crop these things out. All right, so we'll click OK. And now the water mill is straight up and down. All right, well, I hope you found this helpful. Um, I know this is... Uh, a great feature and um, I was a little confused about how to zoom in uh, and wish I had a tutorial to watch so thought I'd make one real quick all right thanks so much and talk to you later bye